been feeling trapped down on the floor I don't know what for Feels like I'm gonna lose Silence takes a hold I can't let it go Chain up, no one knows But I won't let the stormy seas Throw me in open water Let me have my peace And leave me to tomorrow Wind into myself Away from things I let go Floating on the way We go bottoms up we are not professional fiberglass fabricators, and this is not intended to be an instructional video. Always consult a professional when working on your boat. Be safe. Hey you, tell me what you're doing. Cutting a mold. A mold for what? Companion way. Out of cardboard? Yep. What's it gonna be made out of eventually? Fiberglass, hopefully. So you're gonna use the cardboard to create a mold and then form fiberglass around it? Mm-hmm. So the first thing we had to do is get a good idea of what it should look like. cut and cut, and shaped and shaped, and taped and taped. We cut, taped, and shaped, until finally we were confident that when it was all said and done, it would fit where it was supposed to. Our next step was to pre-cut a ton of fiberglass mat strips. It definitely wasn't easy to make sure that they would fold and bend everywhere they needed to fold and bend. We had to really think it through and make sure that each piece would go where we needed it to go. Next, we cut strips of wax paper and lined the entire mold with it. Here we needed to make sure that the wax paper stayed flat and, and under our first layer of fiberglass mat. We mixed pretty big batches of polyester resin. It was 64 ounces each time.
we fully saturated uh, each layer of the mat. Uh, the tough part was pulling the polyester resin up the walls and trying to form the, the fiberglass mat over the lip. The goal was, in the end, for sure, to overbuild the whole thing so if we need to make cuts to fit it, we can. We used thicker fiberglass sheets to form the bottom and then we used a little bit thinner more pliable sheets on the edges so that they would make the lip that we were looking for. And then we laid another thicker layer on top to tie it all together. Strip by strip, we thickened it up layer by layer until we were comfortable with our first cast. We were still having trouble getting that lip to fold over. The fiberglass mat just wanted to keep coming back and straightening out. So Aiden had a great idea. We ended up taking wax paper and, and placing it all around the entire edge and taping it down to hold that angle in that angle of the edge in place for us.
This is only part one of creating the companionway. So check back again. Happy Thanksgiving. Hit the like, subscribe, and notification bell. Thanks for joining us.